Hey folks, welcome to Shooting Up North. I'm your host, Lewis Carlin. We're heard right here on the Alliance Pro Wrestling Network. Thank you so much for joining me again today. MLW locking up another one of their top stars, signing Mads Kruger to a long-term deal, a new long-term deal, um, according to PW Insider. Uh, so uh, PW Insider here reporting uh, indicates Mads Kruger, aka Logan Creed, has signed a new long-term multi-year deal with Major League Wrestling. Uh, PWInsider.com can confirm Kruger currently undefeated in MLW storylines will be getting a massive push as a heel monster in 2022 with the idea of eventually pitting him against Jacob for two and that should be an absolute all-out war between the two uh, Jacob for two of course turning babyface coming out of um coming out of the end of Contra and the War Chamber match. Uh, Kruger, uh, as Krieg, initially debuted for the promotion in 2019, um, and he uh, debuted uh, 2012 in the Georgia area. Uh, so Matt Kruger getting a long-term um, contract, long-term deal to remain with uh, MLW. And my, God, my goodness, MLW doing the right thing, man. They're locking up their top stars. I previously reported that they locked up, uh, that they signed Davy Richards to a long-term deal. Uh, the MLW World Heavyweight Champion, Alexander Hammerstone, signed a long-term deal with them. And now Madge Kruger uh, signing another long-term, signing a long-term deal with them um, uh, in advance of a monster push. So he's going to be pushed heavily in 2022. And I'm looking forward to the Madge Kruger, Jacob for two program. That's going to be an absolute all-out war, as I said, when, the, when those two step in the ring against each other, it's going to be a, just a fantastic, fantastic match. Really looking forward to that. Um, also, in more MLW news, uh, Tajiri, the MLW World Middleweight Champion, will be defending the title in the UK against Jody Fleisch. Uh, so this is Fightful.com um, indicating here Tajiri is traveling to the UK. MLW announced that Tajiri will defend the MLW World Middleweight title against Jody Fleisch on February 19th at World Pro Wrestling. Uh, Tajiri previously defended the title against Atsuki Ayagi in Japan. Uh, and here is a uh, statement from MLW. I'm not going to read the whole thing because uh, it's a kind of a long statement here. But um, following the historic win over At Atsuki Ayagi uh, to retain the World Middleweight Championship, uh, Tajiri has lined up another high profile title defense. Um, this marks the second international title defense by the world middleweight champion uh, with All Japan uh, Pro Wrestling hosting the first title bout. MLW has confirmed cameras will be rolling for the historic championship bout in the event a title change occurs. In speaking with the Japanese buzzsaw, Tajiri informed MLW that his goal as champion is to defend the world championship against the top ranked wrestlers of each country. Uh, will Tajiri continue his impressive reign as champion uh, or will Fleiss be crowned the first British world champion in MLW? Uh, Tajiri is going to win the match. He's not going to lose to Jody Fleiss. Uh, but you never know. You never know what's going to happen. Uh, but um, it's great uh, to see uh, MLW MLW getting going international. First in the UK, uh, they get a lot of exp they're getting exposure in the UK now. They got exposure in Japan. Uh, they're really bringing a lot of good exposure to MLW and um, Corp Bauer doing the right thing, doing the right thing, in my opinion, um, locking up uh, these top stars of MLW to long-term deals. Um, he's got Tajiri defending the MLW World Championship all over the world, uh, internationally, uh, the US, UK, Japan, who else, who knows where else he's going to defend it. Uh, could be in Mexico, could be up here in Canada, um, but um, Corp Bauer doing the right thing, um, expecting a huge 2022 uh, for, from MLW. Looking forward to it very, very much. Very, very much looking forward to MLW uh, in 2022. As I'm, I'm just thinking of Jacob Patu versus Max Kruger. That's going to be, an, as I said, that's going to be just an absolute tremendous, fantastic, spectacular war between two of the top stars in MLW. And I, I just, I can't wait for them to lock horns to get in the ring and, uh, and have that all out war. It's just going to be fantastic. So once again, expect big things from MLW in 2022. A lot of surprises as well, I think are coming um, from MLW. Okay, we're going to leave it at that for now. I'll be back later today uh, to report on more stuff, to discuss more things. And until then, thank you very much. Take care. Bye-bye and stay safe everyone. So long. Bye-bye.